Today I'm going to reveal exactly how much cash we earn solo mining Bitcoin for 24 hours on our Raspberry Pi. So here's my plan. First, I bought an Antminer USB stick off of eBay. This is essential. What's an Antminer, you ask? It's what you call Antman when he was still a young lad. Get it? Because he was an ant. Mine. And Ant Miner is the most powerful USB crypto miner in the world. And this particular piece of hardware is designed to do only two things look cool and run the SHA 256 hashing algorithm, which is the algo used by most blockchains to mine crypto. And just to give you a sense of this thing's power, when I mined Monero on my Raspberry Pi using the quad core CPUs, I was clocking in about 10 hashes per second. Meanwhile, this USB stick can generate over 2 billion hashes per second. Call me Snoop Dogg because that's a lot of. But will it be enough to earn us any Bitcoin? Let's find out. It actually is possible to strike it rich with nothing but a Raspberry Pi and an ant miner. And if you want to do that, you're going to need to perform solo mining, or what we in the business like to call lotto mining. So unlike mining in a pool, where you join other miners and share in any block rewards based on the hash power you contribute, auto mining is an all or nothing proposition and will give us the opportunity to hit a block reward and receive over $200,000 in a single go. This one lucky USB miner hit it big when he woke up to find that his micro rig had struck digital gold, adding a new block and netting a reward of more than $270,000. Get this man a coffee. First, we have to get our Bitcoin address from Coinbase wallet. Then we'll connect the ant miner to the Raspberry Pi and boot it up. I know my desk is messy, deal with it. You'll know the ant miner is on when you see this red LED light up. Next, we'll install CG Miner, a popular open source Bitcoin mining software onto our Raspberry Pi. And once everything's set up, we'll go ahead and run the mining script using a solo mining pool. And now we know the miner's running because we can see this green LED begin to start blinking. So I let the miner run for a few hours, devoured a bag of Takis, and came back to find this thing gets super hot. I can barely touch it right now. I could probably fry an egg on this thing. But CG Miner says we're generating a hash rate of over two giga hash per second, which is actually pretty good. So here's the truth. Lotto mining is a gamble. You could get lucky and hit an entire block earning over $200,000, but there are no guarantees. And if we want to better understand our odds, we can use solochance.com to find out how likely we are to win. So I went ahead and entered the three giga hash per second that I was seeing when I was running my miner. And according to this, our odds each day of hitting the next block are about one in 650 million. So are are those odds better than playing the actual lottery? Well, I looked up the Florida State Lottery and it looks like to win $100,000, there's a game that has a one in three million odds of winning. So it looks like you'd actually have a better chance of winning the real lottery. But if you do hit a block reward, this is incredibly profitable. 